Hey guys, welcome to your general reading for Aries. This is going to be for your November 2024. You can apply this to any of your placements. We are going to take a look and see what important messages we have for you guys, okay? Could be anything, and you can, anything could come up. So uh, apply this to your own unique situations. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post so when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to book a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So, tell me about, um, tell me about, uh... Aries. What important messages do we have here for Aries? What important messages do we have here for Aries? For November 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, or Saturn. Like I said, this could be in any of your placements. Okay, so we have the Nine of Pentacles here. Virgo energy, pre-empress energy here, and the Ten of Wands, okay? And also we have the Six of Swords, okay. You know, I do feel like you guys are financially in a very, very, very good and sound place right now. But I feel like you could be feeling like the weight of the world is on your shoulders right now. You know, you could be taking on, you know, your own burdens, other people's burdens here. But I feel like with the Six of Swords here... I do feel like over time, things will start to improve. Things will start to alleviate here. Okay, the nine of uh, the nine of pentacles, ten of wands, and also we have the six of swords. Okay. So, you know, I do feel like, you know, there is a situation where I feel like you're in right now. I feel like you're having a difficult time navigating through it. It just seems like, you know, I feel like you're dealing with a lot of pressure. But I feel like in the next, I feel like in the next six weeks or so, okay, I do feel like things will start to get better. Okay, I think you, maybe you're going through some sort of tough transit or something like that, Aries. But yeah, I see things getting better here. I see things becoming more stable and balance here. What else does Aries need to know? What other important messages does Aries need to know right now? What other important messages does Aries need to know right now? For November 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Aries. For Aries. We have the Two of Pentacles and the Judgment card, Sagittarius Energy. Okay. We also have the Two of Swords and the Three of Swords here. Mm. I, I feel like you're going through a lot here, Aries. I feel like you're juggling a lot. Like I said, you're under a lot of pressure here. Another thing I'm getting is that some of you guys are like deep, deeply empathic, psychic. You know, some of you guys have, you know, psychic abilities, mediumship abilities. And I feel like you're taking on not just the burdens of other people, but also the spirit too, okay? So, you know, this could be a very specific message for somebody here that is deeply empathic, you know, just could feel everything here. You know, some of you guys could be f feeling f f physical symptoms of these spirits that, you know, passed away. All right. The Six of Swords here and the Four of Swords and also the Chariot here. Yeah. Um... Uh, yeah, I, I just feel like ener your energetic field is just really open at this time here, Aries. And I feel like the most important thing that you could do is protect yourself. Is to have strong energetic boundaries with spirit here, okay? Not just with people, but with spirit, all right? So uh, we also have the Two of Pentacles and the Knight of Swords. The Judgment card. And the magician here, Gemini Virgo. I feel like some of you guys are chasing new goals here too. Some of you guys are really ma master manifesting at this time here. Okay, definitely creating the life that you want. 
But I also feel like you guys, uh, I feel like one of the things I'm getting is that some of you guys could be doing too much or that you guys are overextending yourself for other people here or for, you know, spirit here too. Uh, two of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. The uh, Three of Swords. Why is it Three of Swords here? And also the Ten of Cups. Um, some of you guys could be re releasing at this time heartbreak pain over a relationship that you guys are dealing with here okay you know some of you guys could also be feeling like you know there's a family situation that's not going really well where there's there could be loss uh, that you guys could be dealing with at this time here okay you know i feel like even though you're going through a lot or that you're doing a lot you know it's so important for you to turn within and take care of yourself at this time here the four swords and also the devil the hierophant here and also the ten of wands again mm. this is interesting um I, I do believe that some of you guys could be getting some sort of energetic you guys are getting energetically attacked by certain spirits here, by bad spirits here, such as like in your sleep or something like that, okay? Uh, you know, some of you guys might think it's like sleep paralysis or something like that, which it can be, but you know, I also feel like there's something going on in your sleep here. Like I feel like you guys are not sleeping a whole lot. If you guys are sleeping, okay, you guys are not really, really sleeping because I feel like you guys are also doing energetic work in your sleep here. Okay, the Nine of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, also the Ten of Wands, and Temperance, Sagittarius Energy, and the Six of Swords, and also the Ten of Pentacles here. Okay. You know, some of you guys could be going through a really difficult time in a romantic relationship right now. Okay. Now, if there's no separation here, I just feel like you guys are going through some sort of emotional roller coaster here with your person here. But I, I do get the sense that you and your person here are willing to work together to fix things here. Okay. So it seems like you're definitely going through some sort of like obstacle here where, like I said, you're overextending yourself. You feel like uh, other people's burdens or, you know, even the uh, burdens of spirit is weighing very heavily on you and I do feel like uh, at some point here it will be released here okay so yeah this is a pretty specific message here and I do feel like it has a lot to do with being over overwhelmed by spirit here and this is just a matter of energetically protecting yourself here okay so Aries I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.